Hey guys, how's it going? This is Jeff. I'm gonna do my promised review on this Amazon Amazon niche finder or niche. How do you say it? Niche or niche? I call it niche out of habit. I call it both. I don't know. Anyways, this is my review on the Amazon niche slash niche niche finder, and I've got to say, so far, I'm really, really freaking impressed. And I already found a few winners because I'm gonna buy and I'm, I'm gonna buy a new domain name today based on what I found in it, and based on my keyword research, I should be on page one within three to five days without doing SEO, which is insane. <laughs> Anyways, check it out. The Amazon Niche Finder is you get signed in here, obviously, and you're able to choose um, different categories th through Amazon. I mean, you've got every category possible, appliances, art, automotive, etc. Uh, in this example, I'm going to go to shoes, and what I'm actually going to be doing is looking for trail shoes, because I know that runners are pretty hardcore about stuff, and um, they like their shoes because it makes a huge difference. I'm not really much of a runner because I hate it. I do walk a lot and I try to exercise though, and I know the value of a good shoe. So, uh, when you do a search, it's going to search, you can choose, if you look at my mouse here, only by the top brands, or you can search by all brands from A to Z. So we're going to do a search for just the top brands right now, so the shoe brand names. And you can also choose, by the way, to search for you know, shoe name review, shoe name sale, shoe name discount, shoe name brand plus keyword, or blank, which I don't, I think blank is just a product name by itself. Um, so in this example, I'm going to look for the shoe name, the product name, plus the word review. So I'm going to type in trail, because I'm looking for trail shoes. And I'm going to do category shoes, and I'm going to click on the first option for find, find products and um, whatever else I said before. <clears throat> and here we are. We've got a whole bunch of different products right here. If you look at the, you got the brand name right here, Adidas Review, Atrix Review, A6 Review, and the products, which means there's one, this is the number of products that particular brand has, at least on Amazon. Obviously, the more the better. However, if you find one with a lower number, that's still okay. It's going to be easier to target. So the next step is we're going to click on the analyze. Now, what this is going to do is it's going to go through. It's going to do a domain check to see if there's a .com, a .net, or .org available. It's going to tell you the competition, which is how much competition there is for that brand, meaning how many exact results in Google, which I love. It saves me having to search for it. And it's going to give you the strength of the niche, which means the competition of the competition of strength for that brand. It kind of combines two things how many searches there are and how easy it's going to be to rank and so far I'm blown away in fact I'm going to show you guys right now how it works so we're going to click on analyze and this is going to take about 30 seconds or so so I'm going to run downstairs and grab some coffee or grab some water that is and I'll be back in just a moment so the magic of pausing watch this okay it's been about a minute and it's still searching if you look on the right in the middle here now it's shown the domain check. It's showing which domains are available. And you can look at the status. If you look at the bottom, watch right there, you'll see what it's researching. This is going to take another minute or three, so I'm going to pause it. But uh, real quick, if you're not doing this yet, make sure you watch this in full screen. I'm going to, ex I'm going to put this in HD. Um, so yeah, you're going to have to see my face in high definition, unfortunately, but it will really give you a much better view of this product and how it works. So, having said that, I'm going to pause it, and I'll be back in another moment. And I'm back. It actually took about two more minutes to run. However, I took a quick break, used the restroom, and not that it, not that it matters. So check it out. We got a few things here now. We've got our keywords on the left side here. We've got how many products there are. We've got a domain check. Check this out. AdidasReview.com is available. That's insane. Um, so what I want to look at here is if you look at the strength right here, the more green something is, the easier it's going to be to rank for. So right here it shows red. That's going to be pretty difficult. This one's full green. It's going to be awesome. That one's in the middle. It's going to be eh, so so. So I'm going to put them in order of strength right here. And I'm going to look for, just kind of scan down these real quick here. Okay, this ain't bad. Let's put them in order by green. That's not working. 
I'm not sure what I'm doing here. Anyways, if you look, I've only been using this for a day now or so. But check it out. There's one that really caught my attention here. Um, and again, I'm not a runner, but I understand there's this new barefoot phenomenon with these. Have you seen these barefoot shoes, the ones with the five toe holes or just the real thin ones so people can feel like they're connected to the earth? It's kind of a big trend in running right now. And I happen to know they sell rather well. Well, one that caught my attention was Vivo Barefoot Review. But check it out. What we're going to do here. Hold on a second here. We're going to select only green. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, you check it out. You can right click in here and you can select only ones that are a certain color. So I'm going to right click and select only green. Now, watch this. I'm going to click on copy to clipboard. Now, for some reason, I don't know why, but this probably is, is a bug right now, but they're adding the word review twice. So look at this Atrex review space review. So what I'm going to do is copy those. I'm just going to go into a new email with an Outlook real quick. And I'm going to fix that with a little find in a search here. So we're going to search for review, space review. And let's see if I can replace that with simply the word space review. Wonderful. So now we have our words properly done with the word review. And I'm going to open. You can copy the clipboard and open up in AdWords. So let's go ahead and try that see what happens here. All right, beautiful. Just opening this up within the Google Keyword Tool. So I'm going to paste my keywords back in here. And I'm going to click, click on Search. And what I'm going to do right now, by the way, is get the monthly search volume to find out which of these products are getting searches and maybe which ones I should target. All right, and this is actually pretty decent. Now, normally, I'm the first person to tell you to uncheck broad and use exact. The difference is if you do a search for something in broad, for example, this top one, it's going to give you any website that has the, the words Atrix and review. So it might give you results for someone saying, this is my review on Atrix. It might give you re results that say, this is my Atrix brand or my Atrix shoe review, for example. Um, but I like this because this gives you potential of how many people are still searching for items related to that because this one is so easy. Now, obviously, I explained before that I'm a real big fan of this one particular word. Where did that go? That um, barefoot one. Hold on a second here. Ah, there it is. The Vivo Foot Barefoot Review. So what I'm going to do is go back to the tool real quick here. Close that. Now if you look on the right side, there's one thing I forgot to show you, the competition numbers. What that is, is that is exactly how many results there are for Google for that phrase within quotes. You guys know I'm a big fan of doing this. I'm just going to show you. So we're on the Google. What is it? Vivo Barefoot View. All right, we got 4,250 right there. Look at the mouse. And if we look right here, it shows 4,250, which is insane. Now, guys, pay attention here. I'm going to show you a trick how to take this one step further. I'll be honest. Anything under 15 or 20,000 is going to be easy to rank for when you have it in quotes. If you look at something like this with only f less than 5,000 results, that's freaking easy. This is genuine excitement. So I'm going to take this one step further. Check this out. I'm going to go to the front of this phrase. Come on. And I'm going to add the words in title colon or whatever that's called. Cat fur. And I'm going to click on search once again. And what that's going to give me is how many results we have with somebody that has the words Vivo Barefoot Review in the title, which is that very top of line. For example, right here or right here. And you know what this means? 34. And that means there's only three legitimate. 34 people legitimately targeting this phrase. And you know what? Some of those might be backlinks. You know what this means? With proper on-page SEO, it should be really, really easy for me to get ranked. But you know, I'm going to take this even another step further. So pay attention. One of my favorite tools that I use all the time is called Traffic Travis, which is free for the limited version. Traffic Travis 4, I'm going to put a link down below for that. Um, check it out. We're, we're gonna, if you go to the competition tab, right, SEO tab, and select competition, you can type in as many keywords as you want. And it's going to give you information on that particular keyword. 
It's going to give you the difficulty, relatively easy, the average page rank of the site, the average backlinks. Um, but we're going to click on view details. This is what I really want right here. Oh my gosh, man. Have you guys ever used Traffic Travis? Basically what it does is it shows you everything about the top 10 or top 20 results. In this example, it's going to show us how many people are properly optimized for the phrase Vivo Barefoot Review. Do they have that phrase um, in their title? Does the keyword appear in their description, in their H1 tag? Those right three, those are the ones you want to pay attention to because that's going to show their on-page optimization. These other two, uh, DMOZ, is if they have a DMOZ listing. That's usually going to be big-time businesses. For example, YouTube, Amazon, um, which do have them as well. It is possible to get them for niche blogs, but you want to make sure you've got a real legitimate blog, not just five or six pages. So we're going to ignore that for now. But check this out. Not one single person is properly optimized for this phrase in the top 20 results. If you look at the left side here, this is amazing. No one is optimized for that phrase at all. That's freaking insane. So you know what this means? The less green, the better. This person right here for Game Train, it looks like an affiliate site. Look at this, hold on. Game Game and Train, okay, not, never mind. GameandTrain.com. I mean, that's one guy that has it in his H1 tag and his title, but he does not have it in his in his description. Um, so it's going to be easy to beat. In fact, I am seriously very, very confident that if I buy VivoBarefootReview.com, I'll be able to get that ranked on Google on the page on page one within a week with zero SEO. So check it out. Let's go ahead and go a little bit further here. Let's go into Amazon and see what they're selling here. And I'm, the only reason I'm going so far is I'm trying to give you give you guys the potential and showing you what you can be doing here. Now, um, so let's take a look, see what these products go for in Amazon. Okay, Vivo shoes, men's shoes, up to 160 bucks. 99 bucks. So this is pretty good. This is pretty good indeed. Uh, with Amazon, once you get enough sales, it's very, very easy to get 8%. So yeah, you know, you're not getting 30 or 50%, but if I make one sale for shoes that's 160 bucks, what is that commission on that? And if you guys know me, you know my math sucks. Let's take 160 times 8%. That's 12 bucks. $12.80 per sale on something that's going to be very, very easy for me to get ranked for. Now, here's the thing. You might not think, okay, Jeff, that's nice. You might make a few hundred bucks a month. But yeah, that's it. I'm going to have to do zero backlinking for this phrase. I'm going to do simple, proper on-page optimization, which you should hopefully know if you've been a follower of mine for a while. And I'm going to get this ranked within the first week on page one. And I guarantee you, I'm going to make sales within the first week or two. And it's going to be that easy. It's going to take me one hour to set up the entire site. Then I'm going to simply rinse and repeat, make more sites, target more money, make more money on Amazon, because that is how I roll. And so let's just kind of check one more thing thing here. Let's make sure that this product is not lying. And let's make sure my, my domain name is available. VivoBarefootReview.com Unless someone just stole it from me. Come on. VivoBarefootReview.com is available. That's insane. This is... I'm, I'm not... I'm not being goofy or silly. I'm genuinely excited. You guys know I recently built my other um, Amazon page for the product for the Zeti Blue Mi the Blue Yeti microphone, which is right here. So if you guys don't know, this is one website I built a week and a half ago. Actually, a week ago, I'm um, pr promoting the Blue Yeti microphone on Amazon. In fact, I've done only a little bit of backlinking so far, and this site's already on page three right now. Let me show you real quick. This site's only on page three. Already on page three for the phrase Blue Yeti Microphone. And it took me uh, about an hour to build the site, including writing two articles, maybe an hour and 15 minutes total. And it was on page six within the first two or three days. Let's see here. I was on page three this morning. Let me see if I'm still on page three. It might have jumped down to page four. Let's check page two. Okay, so it's not there anymore. It looks like my rankings are jumping around, so I'm going to need a little bit more backlinking to do this. But even still, the phrase Blue Yeti Microphone, while it's easy to rank for, for me, take a look. If I put this in quotes, Blue Yeti Microphone, 
I've still got 143,000 results, which is not horribly difficult if you know what you're doing, but it's still decently competitive. If you look at the other thing, if you look at this phrase right here I showed you a second ago, for Vivo Barefoot Review, it's got nothing. It's only like 4,000 results, so I'm going to be able to get that ranked much easier and earn much quicker than this Blue Yeti one. This Blue Yeti one, I expect to be page one within a week or three, maybe four weeks, I don't know. It's a bit more competitive. It might take me upwards of a month, but it's going to pay off very, very nicely, which, of course, I am all about. Um, so, yeah, guys, I really hope you get what I'm talking about here. This product is insanely amazing. It's insanely simple to use, and it's going to help you find profitable niches insanely quickly. Let me, let me get your attention. Let's, how about this? Let's say, okay, Jeff, that's cool, but I don't want to build a small little site that's only going to earn me a few hundred bucks a month. Think about it. Don't be stupid. Don't be a dumbass, okay? Look, look at this. Let me show you some potential real quick here. I'm going to go into the keyword tool once again, and we're going to break down the searches here for Vivo Barefoot Review. Vivo. And because it's actually a properly spelled one word, Vivo Barefoot, but people would probably want to space those out anyway, so I'm going to safely guess that people are going to be type searching for that both ways the the, in, the proper and the improper way so check it out uh, I was correct here we are and again remember this this is the broad results so what this is is this 2400 is people searching for the words vivo barefoot review maybe combined with other words maybe vivo barefoot reviews maybe vivo barefoot evo review for example right here this phrase right here Vivo Barefoot Evo Review, that includes those words, so that's, still, that's going to be included within those. I mean, there's really a lot of potential here. I'm going to pause this real quick, and I'll be back in a second. Okay, and I'm back. What I did was I broke it down, I broke it down a bit further, Brooke. I broke it down a bit further, and I found some more phrases that are being searched for for this. Now, of course, it's not going to give me every single one, but let me try, um, let's try this. Hold on. Review of Vivo Barefoot Shoes. And keep in mind, that's not one that came up in my, in my results here, so I'm curious if that gets any searches or not. Okay, that one does not, but that's still pretty good numbers right there. Each of these numbers here is the amount of people searching for a month for this particular phrase, which is pretty freaking good. So let's go ahead and go into exact results, which is how I'm going to break things down further to get a more realistic review as to how much these are getting searched for. Now, keep in mind, once again, those broad results are great because that's going to show you how many people search for how many people have those two words in their search together? So I mean, someone might search for review of the e uh, review of the Vivo barefoot shoes, or or new Vivo barefoot shoes review, or review of the barefoot shoes by Vivo. That's kind of an example, and it's unfortunately not going to give me every single one. But let let me show you guys a quick example of the earning potential. What I believe could be for this site, real quick. And again, this is a site. This is going to take me about an hour to build and no work at all to get ranked. So let's go ahead and do the math here. Take 170 plus 260 plus 58 plus 73. And that negative 10 means there's less than 10 searches. I'm just going to go with 10 anyways. So that gives us 571 searches per month for these combined phrases, which are all pretty easy, except for this one to rank for. Ah, uh, let's see here, Vivo. In fact, I don't know why. This one says high competition in here. I think that's just for ads. But I, sh I showed you guys before, it's really, 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 really easy to rank for. So ignore the competition levels for that. So let's say we have 571 searches per month. And let's say we get number one in Google for every single one of those phrases. We can expect from those 571 searches, we're going to get a cool 45% of the traffic, which is 256 searches per month. So let's see here, let's add this to memory, 256. Oops. I lost my, oh, it was a 256. Let's say we have 256 visitors per month just based on these searches right here. And again, don't get me wrong, there's going to be a lot more searches right now that people are going to find me, find my site via, that I'm not even accounting for. So it might be three times this much. But let's say we have that 256, right? And then let's say, 
that out of those 256 visitors per month, only 5 out of every 100 decide to buy those shoes via my affiliate website on Amazon. So let's take 256 multiply by 5%, that's going to be 12.8 sales per month, which again does not sound like a whole lot, but let's take those 12.8 sales. <clears throat> 12.8. And let's say we're going to be getting an average of, let's say, 15 bucks per sale. That's an easy $200 a month right there based on those phrases alone. And do you think it's worth it? Hell yeah. If you build five of these sites per week, that's a thousand bucks a week for the first week. If you build 20 of these sites per month at an hour each, you're looking at a cool 4,000 bucks per month. And you know what? This is one of the less competitive phrases out there. This is one of the easy ones to rank for that's not really searched for as much. Um, my video is 20 minutes, so I'm really hoping that YouTube, Facebook will accept this. If not, I'll put it on YouTube. Okay, so check it out. One thing you can even do further, you say, okay, Jeff, that's cool, but 200 bucks isn't enough for me. Have you made, have, if you have, let me start over here. If you're brand new, 200 bucks, it, it might not seem like a lot because you know there's some people like myself making two, 300, 500 bucks per day, but that's a great start. That's something you can upscale. I'm not trying to sell you on this method. I'm actually doing this method myself. I've shown you guys my Blue Yeti site. I'm showing you this domain name I'm going to buy. In fact, I'm going to show you in a few days once it's bought and built. I'm not trying to sell you on some, some method that does not work. That's my point. I use this method myself and it works insanely well. So check it out. Let's say you want to take things one step further here. Let's say, okay, Jeff, that's cool, but I want to, I want to be bigger than this. You know what you can do? TrackShoeReviews.com, that might be available. You can do reviews on all of these. Atrix, Echo, Garmont. I mean, I know some people that have review sites that are making 25, 30,000 per month because they review multiple different types of items. So as you can see, the potential seriously is the potential is unlimited for how much you can earn doing this. I know people on Amazon making a quarter million per year. I know people making a half million per year just as an Amazon affiliate. You know why? Because they're not targeting the big things. They're not targeting the huge, crazy, competitive things everyone else is going for. They are targeting the small things that are going to be easy to rank for, which is where this is going to help you help you come in handy. I mean, look at this. You can do kitchen knives, home and, home and kitchen. You can do lawn mowers. They sell for 500 bucks each. You can do cell phones, computers, electronics. I mean, imagine doing luxury luxury watches. You know the might sell for five or eight hundred bucks a pop. They're, and this is just one little thing I'm doing. What if I was doing a review for a luxury luxury watch? It sold for three thousand bucks a pop. There's I mean literally unlimited potential here for how much you can make and how much you can do with this. And it's gonna be insanely easy. And it's not gonna take any work to get ranked at all. So I mean seriously, I'm excited genuinely because this is amazing, this is awesome, and this is something I'm gonna be using daily now, and I'm really, really glad I discovered it. So guys, that is really all I'm gonna say for now. Uh, as for me, I'm gonna go buy that domain name, Vivo Bare Vivo Barefoot And um Hey, I'll see you in the winner's circle. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, let me know. Do me a favor and like and comment this if you have any questions. Um, check it out. Lay down, fat ass. <laughs> I forgot to mention one thing, and I'm so, so sorry. Um, there, This also comes with a seven-day Amazon cash strategy guide that tells you exactly how you can build sites, exactly how to get them ranked, exactly um, what you can do day by day for every single day. And this gives you really, really, really phenomenal ideas, including giving you different themes you can use uh, for your WordPress themes. I mean, for example, here's one right here, Site5's Simplo Template. This is one free WordPress site. Let's take a quick look real quick and see how this looks. This is one you can download for free to build. Let's take a look. Is this it? Well, that's not bad. That's a pretty pro-looking site. I mean, that's simple. But I like it. That's really nice. You can download this template right here for free, which I think is pretty freaking cool. Uh, he also goes through how to build the sites. Let me show you, Rook, see if I can find that here. Here we are. Here we are. Some real cool tips on how you can optimize the site. Of course, in his opinion, I don't really do all of these myself, but I mean, yes, you want to use a logo. And check this out. This gives a real cool strategy. Amazon often discounts items. So you can legally and safely put on sale at Amazon for 55% off. 
Um, and the reason for that is Amazon will often say, you know, regular price 149, buy it here for 99.99. So you can say in that example, buy it for 33% off, which is what I'm doing. So this gives you really, really, really a full-on template, a full-on strategy for SEO, on-page, off-page, for everything you can do. I mean, if you're a brand spanking newbie, if you've never built a website before in your life. 100% true, this guide gives you everything you need to do in order to do that. And that is pretty freaking cool if you ask, if you ask me. Um, oh, nice, okay. So, I mean, it's 33 pages, 31 pages, and it literally does show you every single day what you need to do, how many articles to write, how you do the articles, how you position the articles, how you need to get your site ranked, how to set up Amazon. So I mean, it really does cover everything you need and then more. So forgive me, I'm just going to add this video to the end of the last one. I almost forgot to explain that. But this is really, really, really a cool guide, and I've already taken some of his strategies and added them to my own site. So hey, I am talking fast because I am excited. Once again, I am going to shut up. I'm going to make this video, and I'm going to go build my site, guys. So, hey, thank you very much. I'll talk to you soon.